I am back with more of the Binding of Isaac. No, don't worry about that. Don't, don't worry about that. No, that, that file doesn't matter. This one is better. But, to prove the point, 54 and 46, not great, but good. Definitely better than I was ever at at Isaac. But, the main thing I'm wanting to say here is much, much worse. See? So you're getting the cream of the crop here. Winning streak of two. Less than uh, one to two kill death ratio. I'm not ready. I've been playing, but no. Ugh, Eden, darkness. Lazarus. Well, that's, that's Eden. <coughs> hmm. Hoping for something good. So we've got, uh, as I can see, Book of Boom. And ow in my head. Oh, we should check our stats. See, whatever. Um, so we've got good range and damage. But concussive tears. And book of boom. So let's go ahead and use a book right here. Ugh, I'm so bad with the controls. Cause I, okay, well that might work out. It works out. We get a nice damage up right here. And look at that. Look at that pretty number three. Turns our tears red. I believe all tear effects are aesthetic now. I actually, did I start with that soul heart? I think I did. Not sure why. Of course, that is the randomness of our good buddy here. There's a lot of things I can't get here, but this is the good gluttony fight, where I can actually pick up anything he drops. If we get a health up here, we'll actually be in pretty good shape, I think. And we haven't even found our item room yet. I feel good about taking this. I don't plan on damaging myself too much on this floor. And I mean that literally too much, as in two hearts. Too much. Hey! Okay, we're off to a bad start. I was kind of being wary of the fire, and then I just let it shoot me anyway. That's, why, that's one of the reasons why I don't really like this room. Not because it's a bad room, just because I'm bad. I am worse than the room. I feel like you can only get one shot at the fire. The fire just sneaks at you. It doesn't... You know it's gonna hit you, and you're just like, eh, I don't wanna get hit. And it's like, burn. How can you reason with burning? Opens all doors. It'll save us keys. Which we have two of. But it's far less random and chaotic than the book. And keeps us out of trouble. I get into that shop for free, I don't have any money. So why would I want to do that? Now I want to bomb that rock. You see, see, I'm already arguing against my own logic here. I need one more charge to make this work though. Ugh. Wow, they shoot not me. We can, of course, leave the room to reset their damage. Or not reset their damage, rather. There's a few enemies, if you can call these enemies, in the game like that. I'm gonna hide in here with this heart. No, don't shoot me! You don't want to do that. I want to get a charge, though, for our book here. So we can go back and blow up that rock. So you could argue that we started it with a small rock. And and a couple of extra soul hearts? Well, no, I shouldn't say the couple. Oh, there's one here, too. This seems like the better bet, though. And I should be able to hide behind these rocks over here fairly safely. It's actually a chest, but I have plenty of keys. So we get the key back, so that really wasn't anything great. The only thing I would really ask for now is a better shot speed, or not a shot speed, I think our shot speed is probably just fine, but a tier's rate. But we have a slow movement speed, and arguably I think the, the small rock might still be a speed down. But because of our movement speed, I, wait, is this an XL floor? Oh yeah, it definitely is. So forget everything I was saying. Notched axe. 
And no. Although it is arguably safer than Anarchy. Anarchist Cookbook, rather. It's safer, but not as fun. Has about the same recharge. And it cannot be used offensively. So it is more limited in that respect, but it does have more control. Tough call. We can, however, come back for some of these red hearts if we do. Oh, well, that's not really gonna matter. We'll be able to burn through this fight fairly quickly, though. Lies don't stand a chance. No, sorry, they don't. Concussive tears should help nicely in this fight. At least if uh, the charge ever happens. Which we can kind of direct the flow of that. These gurglings do have a slight amount of knockback susceptibility. As well as magnetism susceptibility, which we won't talk about right now. We just want to make sure it stays light up. Oh, magic mushroom, thank you. I guess I will. So now we have a decent amount of speed again, which is great. It's still a little bit slow, to be honest with you. Oh, okay. That gets me every once in a while the disorientation on Monstro. Where you think he's gonna jump at you and then he just doesn't. I've had him jump on me because of that before. Which is unfortunate. Just clear my throat just a little bit here as I'm slowly losing my ability to make any logical sounds. <coughs> Oh, there we go. Our damage is doing really nice now. Uh, tears and shot speed up. I definitely needed the tears up, so shot speed up won't hurt. Sacrificial dagger, pretty good. And I will not lose my... Eternal heart there. So I'm feeling in pretty good shape. The damage from Sacrificial dagger, unless I am wrong, is pretty amazing. So now all we need is Guardian Angel and the Guillotine, and we will be set for orbitals. That's a best case scenario, of course, though. And because that was an XL4, we're actually doing quite well on time. Very small for an XL4 on the basement, or cellar basement, in this case. But look at that damage from the sexual dagger. Doing its thing. Oh, one round down. Clear two rounds already, or is it just the one? That first round seemed so quick I barely remembered it, but if I remember correctly, this is the third round of this fight. Yeah, huh. What do you know? I don't even know why I fought that room, actually. Maybe I was just thinking I'm awesome. And at this rate, I wouldn't be too compelled to argue with that. Mysterious paper, I actually did cheat on a couple of items. So we could do this floor again, so we need to decide if we want to speed run this one or not right now. Because if we don't speed run it, we can do great things. And I am trying to go dark. So we will keep that in mind, but... Oh, I'm a wizard. Did you know that? Did you know that I am a wizard? Worst kind of wizard, and time wizard. Time wizards can never be trusted. Don't trust me. I'm a time wizard, I could be lying to you right now. Yeah, our shot speed is not all that high, to be honest with you. Oh, this is the... Oh, no, it wore off. I was going to say, this is actually a pretty good room to have the Aryan Wizard effect. Might be able to take out those two wallies right away. The biggest problem with Aryan Wizard is it doesn't pick one direction, it fires both of them. So we're set for keys on this floor. Obviously, golden key. Infinite floor keys! And that's not all I can do on my floor show, because I am not a wizard! Not a wizard! I was lying about that earlier. Totally not a wizard. Let's see if we can get all of these mushrooms. I'm really not operating on the speedrun process right now. I'm assuming this is going to be a s too slow of a run, because even with the all stats up for the magic mushroom, which I would assume included a speed up. It doesn't feel a lot like it. If it is, it's a small one. We're going in here, we got a lot of money. Eh, not too thrilled with the jar. It's kind of, I'll take the soul heart. It's kind of one of those items where I'll take it under right circumstances. 
But now I don't want to pay for it. Alright, we're at 300. That's where I wanted to be. Unfortunately, we don't get anything for that. I don't know what the next payout is, though. We do have our boss, but I don't think we found our item room yet. No. No, we haven't. Well, I don't know how I feel about that. I feel like I'm going to look for it. Oh, this is not it. Our damage is great. I love being able to take those guys out in two hits, though. It is so nice. It saves a lot of hassle. I probably should just go ahead and stand over here and use my cookbook in here. I don't know if it... Now it doesn't seem to favor one side of the room. I think I got one pill out of that. And it's balls of steel, which is great. They're definitely well protected. If we can somehow get a lot of balls of steel pills, we'll be good to go. We can do that to an extent. Okay, we're going with this. The shears! I'm definitely taking that trade. So I feel really good if we can get some recharge items for going to the dark room. Which we're actually going to start calling it by its name now. Because why not? I'm going to hang on to this balls of steel pill. Just for a while. Uh, I'm out of bombs. So we wouldn't have held on to the other spacebar item we had found very long either. I've already forgotten what it is, apparently. Uh, Maggie's face is a trinket which will give us a eternal heart at the beginning of every floor, and we're in pretty good shape to make good use of that, even though we have no other choice on trinkets anyway. But I'm nervous about getting in too close with the dagger, because this enemy does suck, and I mean that in the most literal way. Not the figurative way of his bad enemy. He's actually not bad. And we... Of course, if he does suck, we know we have a little window to get in there, but I don't think we really need to worry about it now, especially since he's dead. Alright, random pills are random. But we've had a few of these already. 40 hour energy is great. Doesn't really do us much good with the shears, but it's nice to know it's around. Get back to our balls of steel, which we'll have to switch out a couple times anyway, just because of the way things are, and I walked right into that, unfortunately. Let's just go ahead and use this, since we didn't use it in the first fight, and I took another damage, which is so powerful. I'm actually gonna go with... I'm gonna stick with what we got here, because these shears are very powerful, and if we do end up getting some good speed going, which I'm thinking we can, we can definitely do well at the boss rush. So I've had really bad luck getting that. I had a really close run the last one I did for practice. Got there at 20.08, which is 8 seconds too slow. But that's fine. Nope, nothing in there. Pride's not a bad time. Don't really think I get the dagger in there, unless... Okay, we did. I don't want to backtrack for the balls of steel. So we'll just bring it with us. And again, at least at this point, we're doing very well on damage. So I'm not too worried about death, although it would be quick. I could have possibly used to clear out this room and then moved on. Or backtracks very quickly. Probably wouldn't save time. Now this room it might have though. Well there's only two of them left. Not four. And if you would have come up on me, I would have just been like stab, 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 sacrifice you. I'm al I always feel an incentive. In rooms like this to check the end. But not this case. Not this case for a secret. Man, I really wish I was moving faster, because if I have bad paths in the depths, I'm not going to be able to make the time. Really just trying to get the dagger in there. Except for this one. No, we missed! Don't do it again! Ah, I missed again. Okay, let's not miss this time. Alright. There we go. 
We finally made it out. Ooh. Could check for the secret uh, in there, but kind of trying to hurry, and that always bites me. Pretty hard, but the shears are really powerful. Really powerful. They deserve the recharge. I don't know why Krampus' head doesn't have a longer recharge. As powerful as it is, I haven't had the AAA and the 9 volt. I must forget which one. Uh, AAA and 9 volt, yeah. I haven't had those together yet. Um, we're gonna stick with. I don't know what our cards are. If there is even a lineup of cards. Okay, that was silly. I don't feel like they face up very often, that's why I was really looking to dodge there. But we're doing fine. We still have our balls of steel pill. Which we could use at almost any time. Obviously, we can't use it when we're switching between rooms. There's our boss. But we have not found our. Yeah, we haven't found our item room yet, though there are not many places left. It could be. Probably right down here. And it is! What do you know? Look at those dodging skills of luck. Alright, we'll definitely go ahead and use this. See what we got here. Speed down! Not really what I wanted right now. I have to admit that. Do we still have our balls of steel? I'm just gonna go ahead and take it right now. That's why we're so slow, because our balls are made of steel. Alright, this is my favorite Gurdita fight. Won't shoot at me! It just generates flies, which are not even a problem. Although it is hard to see them, so I can't really get up in there too much. Use the sacrificial dagger, sacrificial knife, whatever, for its greatest effect. Just because... well, maybe... Well, I don't want to get hit myself. And I really could use the shears on this fight. I should have, but it's already a little bit too late now. Hey, balls, shot speed up, and a tarot card. Neither which I mind. The Joker, I'm going to go ahead and use this right now, since we did not earn this deal. I could take the dead cat, and it wouldn't even matter. I think that's true, so I'll take it. Because it doesn't even matter. Yep, got my heart right back. So, free dead cat. Just because I had soul hearts. And it does not take away your soul hearts. I really don't want to start dying, but... Okay, let's get through this. Our damage is good, remember? Remember? Remember that good damage we have? Especially since we picked up the pack, which is a great item now. Well, of course it was before too. But now I have it. That's the key here. We're still rocking that speed if we can. Uh, my movement is just so slow though. One of the few times I would really go for a movement speed up. Could really do it. I don't know if I have completed the, uh, the speed. Well, here's our item room, so we can find the boss room fairly quickly. That would be great. Thank you. Oh, okay. X-ray vision is great. One of my favorite items. And while I do say I would have liked to have a speed up, this could give us some shortcuts too. This is our item room. No thanks just now. I only have nine cents. That is a little unfortunate, because it does mean we are kind of on the wrong track. If we have less than three minutes, I don't feel very good, unless we find the fight right away. Okay, not my pro dodge in there. And that's not really professional, that's just knowing that these guys have limited range. Oh, lucky, lucky bastard I am. Couple of keys. Could get into the shop anyway, but no. It's not really what I'm about right now. My shopping days are behind me. Get him. And there's our top secret as well, it looks like. New! No! no brain of the bob for me, thanks. 
I've had my fill. There's an arcade, which we're not gonna play. Not gonna play. I have not seen this room. That's a strange room. Yep, I'll take our health up right now, thank you. And here's a boss. We're gonna use the shears this time, because we're not. Oh! An excellent fight to use the shears on to. Firstly, does mega damage. And I mean that in just a lot of damage. Oh, and another good damage up. So time, four minutes. Okay, we've got four minutes. That's good, if we can get to the boss. And I'm feeling really good about our stats right now for the boss rush. We do have the Curse of the Lost. So no map for us. I'm... I think it's probably a good idea to fight an extra room or two if I need to, just to get the charges on my shears, just for the bomb fight, because it'll go a lot faster then if we are running really tight on time. I don't have any bombs! That stinks! I did not even realize that. I would like to play that. I only have nine cents, though. I don't have any bombs. Can't get any soul hearts there. Ugh. This game right now. I don't remember what any of my pills are. That's... That was an easy room. <laughs> oh! Stop it with your little eternal fly orbital. Now grab him! We don't have time! We do have time, actually, probably. Quite a bit, in fact. Uh, I'd love to gamble. Well, I just like to do it, other than the time consumption part of it. Alright, alright, let's get through this room. And get it on. Uh, Evil Up Demon's Tail. No, we'll stick with uh, Maggie's Faith. It's been rewarding up to us so far. I think we're gonna have to stop here. I think we'd have barely gotten hit. Or we would have gotten hit. And that's not what I want. Not what I'm looking for in this life. Heard the enemies, they were like, I'd hit that. And I was like, no. Uh, I should probably grab that card. I have plenty of keys. I should have a decent number of bombs now, too. Now that I look on it. So. Probably going to be my demise. We do have this, we could maybe make one room fast. Alright, here's our boss. I don't know if I was at the item room or not. Whatever. Just do it. And let's go crazy on winning this. Using the homing sh shot too. I believe it affects both tiers, it's just not showing for the coloration effect. Come on, get in there, body. Okay, plenty of time. Plenty of time. And we could get in there with a sacrificial dagger on the leg as it drops down from the sky. Well, I, I, I say the sky, but it's probably not. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And we want to go dark. We have plenty of time. We can go ahead and check this out first. Fear shot. I always like to take that, so I'm going to. How guppy am I? Am I guppy? I just forget. I'm, I'm a little guppy. We've got seven keys. We can uh, guppy a little bit more. Okay, so we're in here. Ooh, two good choices. Um, I'm gonna have to go with cancer because, of course, soul hearts, and it won't put me over my maximum. But also, it will benefit me the most in the long run. Like, I have a few good pills in there already. But not too worried about that. Damage is excellent. Excellent damage is excellent. And Fear Shot's already paying off here. In addition to the concussion. Cheers, which I've actually quite forgotten about. Oh, that's a good spot for that uh, eighth poop, though. Right down there where I don't ever have to worry about it. That one's not so great. So we only have one to worry about, it looks like. 
Which is great. A great day to put greatness. I'm gonna scout around for any more, just to see. Kind of get the lay of the land, if you will. Oh, okay, okay. I wasn't even looking at you. Maybe I thought that was a familiar of my own. Whoa, how did you die? Seemed like he was alive and well, and then he just died. Is our damage that great? It is that great. <laughs> so never mind about not being great damage. And of course with great damage comes great responsibility. That, that's, I don't know. I'm making up the lies again. I seem to get the clot a lot, which is fine with me. It's a good item. Don't get me wrong. Don't get me at all. Or get me right. I don't care. It's a good item. But it's kind of weird, especially if you're playing with Kane, where it's randomly effective. It randomly works half the time. Half the random working time. I swear I know what I'm talking about. I'm talking about the Binding of Isaac. Reaper. See? I told you I knew. I would like to kill the little guy first. And that is how you get the cellar, so if you don't want to ever fight the cellar, don't kill him first. Because cellar stinks. I'm sure it's fine. It's fine. Alright, I'm going to go after our uh, Duke of Flies? No, no, it's a house, right? No, 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 no. It's this guy. Every skull. I forget. Boom, 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 boom. Just because I want some poop. I like poop. I said it. Maybe we get some money out of the deal. Or more hearts, which I can't really do too much with. I am a little bit short on money. If I come across any beggars, they're going to be about as desperate as I am. Alright, we're at a good spot to move on to the next next phase of this next wave, if you will. You can call it to any wave. Apparently you can, because I just did. I want to get in there with a the dagger, but Chad is still alive. Chad's a jerk. I did, no I'm not. And I was like, yes you are. There we go. That's the dagger. Our knifey. Can you fail? Knife! Knife! Oh, alright. That was the knife. Hey. Let's get behind our protective barrier. It's always good to use protection in fights like these. It's a good lesson for many forms of life. You are, in fact, a form of life. You're a computer program. What are you doing watching? Nothing. I don't know. Don't be a computer program. That's my... Oh, you're over there! My motivational speech for the day. My motivational speech for the day. Don't become a computer program. I got you. I got you. You ain't no monster. You're just a monstro. Monstro Lamari. Nice laser, dude. Laze much? No, no, he's stuck kind of kind of stuck there. This is a really bad room to have the concussive shot on, though. Just because they'll jump the opposite way sometimes, and go that much further out of your view. It's already a little bit difficult to keep track. Knew that laser was coming. He does not seem to, in these big rooms, have as much of a priority on uh, using the laser at intelligent times. Maybe there's sort of a cone of vision he has for using the laser. So you can be further out from him and have him still use it. That seems like a logical assumption. Maybe that would encourage you to be farther away from him when you're fighting. I'm not picking up any soul hearts during this fight, but I'm not taking a lot of damage either, so that's good. 
I only have one orbital, which I would like to have changed. For sure. Alright, next phase. Did I already do the mask? I think I did not. I forget the order right now, apparently. Oh, I thought the mask meant me as a boss. Oh, I didn't even have a charge on my shears. Which, I totally messed up the timing on. I should have saved it. That's not something I need to remember. Just going to the mob fight, I need to remember if I'm doing really well on time, which I was. So just go ahead and save my space mine for this. Because I would have benefited much more using it here. This would have been a whole lot faster. And the mob fight still would have been easy, especially with uh, the homing shot, which we had going as well. But that's fine. Oh, I don't want to be down there. I keep forgetting about the float. I think last time I did the boss rush, he just ignored the fact that he could have lasered me. Alright, well, you're gonna kill yourself, but I want laser... laser bloat to be able to affect the mask. Which it looks like he might have gotten a couple times there. Though so the damage doesn't really reflect it. Oh, watch now for the poop. Hi! It seems like the nice safe spot to fight the bloat from. Alright, how do we kill you? Obviously, we could use our guillotine, but. The dagger should. Oh, the fear. Fear works. We have a nice number of weapons to deal with. Things like you. Oh, I actually got hits in from behind all the time. Seems like it's pretty rare that you can do that against the Mask of Infamy. Okay, I was actually more concerned with getting in a good position for death. Who's coming up next? Alright, alright. Alright! You got me there. You got me there. I will give him that. Unfortunately, I don't have a leech, which I can stick on my bow here. I want to get death off of his horse as quickly as possible. That way, I don't deal with any sides. There's some sides. Which I confused, which is probably terrible. Just because that means it's going to go in a different random direction. Alright, that was the last round of sides. Could get confused, go the wrong way, and then come back to haunt me. Figuratively speaking, of course. So many weapons are dealing with you. Get confused, get feared. You don't know how to handle this, do you? I am too pro for yo. Too pro for yo! Alright, turn around. Do a little dance. No, turn around. Alright. He didn't understand my language, as we all know. These knights, they don't speak the language of Isaac. I don't even speak the language of Isaac. Hey, get away! Get away! I don't even speak the language of Isaac, so how could I expect them to? I don't definitively know the difference between concussive tears and fear. They seem to... Oh, no, I think uh, fear will just make them walk in a random direction. Rather than specifically away from you. Which can actually be better in certain circumstances. Alright, where is the horse? Oh, no, it's just the head. The less head of the horseman. Undefined has appeared in the basement. And we get Bob's rotten head, which I have no interest in. Actually, we do get a soul heart after all. And we'll scrounge through the remains and wreckage of our foes, decapitated and disemboweled, for any more, but we don't find any. And we move on to here. And we have our devil room open still. Which we we're already in, clearly. So let's clear on out of here. And go to the heart. Or the womb, in this case. Okay, room is noted. Nothing of it nothing of interest though. You are so confused, my friend. Let me tell you something. We have a lot of weapons. And no luck, though. 
But I don't know how well... Like, Fear Shot seems to work very well. And... As far as... Rate? Fear Shot seems... If it works every time, potentially. Unless it has, like, some sort of resistance. Because it's not... It, every shot seems to have the effect for it. So it's very powerful. If that is actually how... I could have saved a key by using, or by waiting and using the shears, but that seems kind of pointless for one item. Hello, observation. All right. Well, we got everything back for that. Let me do some potential red heart. Go away. Actually, I almost stepped on that goop. I don't understand that enemy. It's a silly enemy. Like, the goop isn't even dropped from the uh, physical body of that character. It seems to be dropped more from the the chains that are linking it to the wall. Because it won't track it around, even if it does manage to somehow randomly get free. It feels very random when it does get free. That's okay. Yeah, we got a big room. We can deal with a big room. Especially a big room like this. This does not seem very threatening. Was it two and two? I think that's all it is. The range is a little on the low side, only relative to this game. It's actually pretty good. You can shoot off screen. That's all that really matters, isn't it? As long as I can see farther than I can imagine. We're not gonna play the uh, the other one. Just just this one for money take the health up, because that would kill our our eternal heart from Maggie's face. I don't want to do that. I don't want to live that kind of life. Or we could grab this and be just fine. Play it anyway. Play are gonna play. Mm. I don't even know what's the saying. Uh. Of course, we only have to donate uh. halves after the first one. Uh because of cancer, the sign, and apparently we picked up growth hormones, Ew. which is a nice damage up. I'm not at all upset that I picked that up completely by accident. And Mr. Fred, which is a little lame fight, so let's just get this one over with. Seriously, this is the lamest boss. There we go, get in there. Melt him away. He just sits there, he doesn't even move. You have to worry about a couple enemies that spawn in every once in a while. Tears up, shot speed down. Both of, all those things are just fine. That demon paid off very quickly, though. I had a shot speed up at some point, I believe. Yeah, the toothpicks. Okay, we may come back here. Ooh, we definitely need to come back here. Probably. Definitely probably. I can't even pick those up yet, effectively. I mean, I can. But what will it do me, really? Well, we could skip the heart, but why would we do that? We're good to go on that. Not feeling weak. If I can get flight another way, I will come back here as well. But I don't want to grab one of the soul hearts yet, because I have a feeling I will take damage on the floor. It'd be a little bit silly if I didn't. A weird cluster of these enemies. I mean, they do teleport, so it does separate them in that case. They're very, very clustered. And we have a Balls of Steel pill again. So we're pretty well off for health. I mean, we're just not getting hit, is what it comes down to. Because we have really good damage and good crowd control. Yeah, that room totally could have uh, damaged me under other characters' circumstances. Paralysis, that's fine. Now I know what that one does. It's yellow and terrible. I'll remember it. Okay, that was terrible of me. Now who's the bad one? Just because I have all this available health doesn't mean I need to squander and waste it. There's pretty much no way I'm going in there. There's not going to be an arcade on this floor, of course. There's our charge. We'll wait for the goop to go. That's Tammy's head. Which could be good. But I'm thinking shears are really what's going to do it for us. Of 
course, anything that's behind the rope we want to pick up right now. So that's paralysis. Not even going to worry about that. This is an unknown pill, which is bombs are key. Doesn't really hurt me, and I don't think I can make it out of here without picking up this one. But we'll try. Oh, we did make it. And again, if I do end up taking damage from Mom, you know who you are. That's fine. I'll be able to heal all of that. In fact, I'm going to go into this first room because I want to be Guppy. Always. And there's hearts in it. Well, now I'm going to be out of heart anyway for going in there. But again, I was assured that I would be able to recover. Wow! How did I not take damage there? I think that the second little knife. I did it that time. Knife. I'll never get it right. Eventually. Eventually, I won't care. That's basically what that comes down to. Nice shot, jerk. There are more pills that I've not taken yet. That's a little bit surprising. Ooh. Hmm. Forty out or energy or balls of steel. I'm gonna hold on to balls of steel. Pretty much. Probably not use it until the end. It'll save me some backtracking, but I'm going back for the 48 hour energy. That's going to be really good with the shears once we get to the dark room. Or perhaps earlier than that, we could use it earlier than that as well. I feel like the shears would not work well. We're going to go complete one more room. I feel like the shears wouldn't work very well if you had... Or if you were doing Mega Satan. Because I don't think I don't know if you can hit him with his body. That would stink. Okay, that was not a fighting room. I did not fight anything. Why would I abandon my cob so quickly? Get out of here, brain. You're thinking up the place. Actually these are guts. There we go. All right, now we go in, we, we fight Mother and her heart, and destroy it from the inside out. Gotcha, gotcha! Get in there nice and close. There we go, and you're dead. Pretty much the story I'm reading. Alright, we'll just use our balls of steel. And we're going dark. Going dark. Get our 40 hour, 48 hour energy. Out of this secret room right here. Nope, this one. I was thinking about bombing those mushrooms in there, but no point. Well, there is one point, but not enough other points to make the points add up. Couldn't connect the dots on that one. Alright, shield. Alright, well, I kind of took that one. Do we have mega bombs? I want to find out. Meg. No, we don't. And I know, I know. I should kill more of them. But, eh, luck though. Or lucky though, whatever. Not supreme. Uh, this is probably somewhere I want to be. Or it could be a joke. Joke's on me. Ha 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 ha. Hee 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 hee. Yeah, war, make up your mind. Where do you want to be in your life? Six. Reroll everything. No. Thank you, though. To a clubs. Yeah, we can use that. I didn't even think that the dice rooms could appear this late in the game, actually. So now I know that I was wrong about that, which is fine. I don't know if it's just they're more rare at this point in the game, or it's more rare for me to get to this point of the game. Probably gonna take a... No? No? Everything's fine. 
Now if I do find another trinket, I feel like getting rid of Maggie's face would be a good move. And there was another trinket on the previous floor that I kind of just forgot to mention that I was thinking about taking, which probably didn't help me remember to take it. As I've forgotten what it is, too. Really, anything else right now. So I feel like six is kind of like the optimal number of number of hearts to have. At least for me. Uh, red hearts, that is. This could be our item. Could be. Could be. Nope. It is not. Most unfortunate. Gee. Easy room so far in this troll. Even though I took damage there. Just because I'm bad. I don't know why. Wow! Really bad. Alright, well, I don't have to fight in this. There might be a path, but I don't want to fight in that room. I'm not doing very well right now, to be honest with you. And if I lose that red heart, or that uh, soul heart, it'll definitely speak volumes about how bad an idea keeping the trinket was. Then again, I might not. I thought I was for sure going to lose it there, or at least take one hit. But crowd control doing its job. Alright. What What do we have to offer here? And regular chest. I have a lot of bombs now all of a sudden. I'm noticing. No, not there! Not used to that particular room layout, so I... There's another one which is terrible. This one's not bad. I don't mind this one. Just discourages you. Discourages you from being at the edge. The unfortunate thing about the room, though, is they don't ever turn it off. So if you have to pass through... Where is... Where, where am I going? Uh, maybe this way. Could be the right way. I'm actually surprised that I took that middle one out before the end one. Okay, that was not the correct way, though. I'm gonna skip past that room again. I have enough bombs, I should probably... bomb the... Whoa! I was thinking he was about to split there, not fire a laser at me. Okay, get- ah, uh, dang it. I realized what was happening and then it was too late. Oh uh, yeah, top wall's broken down here. In case I hadn't mentioned that. Uh... Well, we lost our- uh, It's not better, but... At this point, without any protection, it's- It can't be much worse. I yeah, probably could use the shears in here. But it's one of those things where now I don't want to. Now it seems like a bad idea. Or at least it's beyond the point where it would have been useful. We might actually not do as well as I was thinking we would. Which is unfortunate. As long as we beat Satan, we're a little bit ahead of the game, though. 40 hour NG. I kind of want to save it though. Probably not the wisest decision I've ever made. But I am not a sage by trade. So I think I'll be alright. Uh, the goat head, a little late now, but we'll take it anyway, because whatever. Oh! Oh! The candy's paying out! The candy's paying out! I have a lot of bombs. Uh, I don't know if I want to bomb everywhere. I don't know if there are tinted rocks in Shoal. It does not appear that there are. I've never actually seen any, but we do have these fires. I wonder if there's a way I can blow all three of those up. There we go. Got them all, but we only get the chariot. Well, we can use the chariot on the boss. Since we're not going to use 48 hour energy, we can either remember to go back for 48 hour energy, or we can leave it where it is. 
There's your bomb. Hey, you guys again. Lee. Okay, well that was a little bit slow and badly done. Okay, how about we use an item, which is good. We're gonna use it here, because whatever. We're gonna spot time as any. I don't know if contact damage is based off of anything, but that seems to be a lot of contact damage. It's entirely possible it is based off of your your tier damage in some way. I wouldn't believe that. Many ways over. I should actually be going aggressively after these feet, because I do have the sacrificial dagger. Okay, we got through it. Got a soul heart out the deal. We can go back for our card, as I actually remembered. Well, it's not a card, it's a trink. What is it? I forgot what it was. Is it a pill? Or was it a card? I don't know! I'm weird. Okay, it was a pill, after all. I know it was something, and I knew that when I found it, I would pick it up. Man, I'm half tempted to re- You know what? Um, we're not Guppy. Maybe we could become Guppy. There's some really bad things that could happen if I re-roll my items, though. Ugh. No! I might lose the... Whole, or the negative. I don't know if that's even something that can happen. Because I don't think I've ever had that re-roll room after the heart. Book of Secrets has appeared in the basement. Uh, yes. For multiple reasons. One, I haven't had it yet. Two, that looks amazing. And uh, lastly, I didn't have those hearts filled in anyway. And I feel very unlikely for that to happen. Speed down, not really interested in that. Thanks for the offer though. Now what I should do, I believe optimally, is I should just use the 48 hour energy right now so that I have charges. And then the extra two will appear on the floor, I believe. Oh, just one. But this way I'll have it ready right when I would want to use it. I don't know how powerful this is. I believe it gives them piercing. So this is... Oh, there's three of them here. Jeez. Well, we're definitely doing some damage then. So there are three in here. And our tier... Well, it was pretty good before too, though, our tier rate. Glad I didn't use the shears in this room, though. Wonder how much it affected the range. Okay. Well, petrified poop. Honestly, I don't know which one's worse. I don't think I'm going to find very much poop other than what I create myself using the other trinket, so it's kind of like, why would I equip that other trinket? If the only time I'm going to get use out of it is when... Yeah, exactly. You know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying. I don't need to explain it. You're smart people. I assume. I mean, I haven't met any of you. But I'll be nice. I'll be nice. I'll we'll just say that you are. I don't have to tell anyone if you're not. Nobody needs to know that. It'll be a secret. And I don't want to be rude, but maybe you don't know you're not. Now, nah. I'm not talking about any specific, just so everyone knows. I'm just being silly. Trail of tears, what else will I do? Eh. I feel like this is a really easy fight. Or at least... Okay, Dark Bomb. There we go. Eh. I wouldn't call it a free win at this point. But it'll help. Probably doesn't even really matter though. To be honest with you. Just because I don't have any health anyway. The moon, take the secret room. This could be bad, just because I don't know where the secret room is. And yeah, I do have to fight my way back up. But we do get a halo of flies, which will complete our orbitals. 
So I want to go up just so I don't have to fight as much. That eh, should be an easy... Oh, we don't have knockback, though. So this stinks! Ugh. So, we're dead. Because <laughs> I don't have knockback with these tears. Okay, we're not dead yet. But dang, that was unfortunate. Wow, I did not see that coming. But basically we're going to have to use uh, this every room now, the shears. Well, we do have a lot of lives to play with, though. I almost forgot about that. Oh, we did find the secret, though. Just in time. One could argue. Alright, we're safe at our range over here. But I really don't think that I'm going to be able to do this next fight without taking any damage. That seems a little bit beyond my abilities. Well, maybe I can take one extra hit now. I have a paralysis pill. That's really going to help me out at some point. How about never? I feel like dropping uh, these items is probably going to be my best bet. Oh, wrong button. There we go. Dropped them right before I switched rooms. So yeah, I'm basically going to have to cower in the corner and cry while the shears do all the work. But I, I don't think I'm going to win because I have one charge. And after this I'd have to fight to get room recharges. <sighs> I just have to hope I don't get hit. That's all I got a chance to do. And that our body does enough damage. Yeah, that was the hit that I couldn't afford to take! Please be something I can dodge or deal with. Okay, we actually won because Shears is way overpowered. Wow, Shears is overpowered, I gotta say. Did I mention Shears and their overpoweredness? Yeah. Because I really didn't do much. Unless the scythes are a lot more powerful than I give them credit for. Which they could be. I didn't think I would do as well in that triple... Not adversary. Uh, I forget the name of the not adversary. The weak version of the adversary. The pre-adversary floor. Because it's not, not dangerous to me anymore. I mean, he can't hit me, but it's not dangerous. But I'm better with the adversary. It's just the double adversary room is terrible. Anyway, thank you very much for joining me, and I will see you in the future.